It is estimated that 539 species have gone extinct in America in the last 200 years, and one-third of America's native species are currently at risk of extinction. 36 million trees are cut down in urban areas each year and are replaced with 167,000 acres of concrete and asphalt. In 2000, the average American consumed 23.7 metric tons of all materials, which is 52% more than the average European. In 1900, the average American consumed less than 2 metric tons of raw materials. In 2006, the average American consumed 13 metric tons. Each day, the average American consumes 2.6 gallons of oil, 9.7 pounds of coal, and 255 cubic feet of natural gas. America constitutes only 5% of the world's population, but consumes 17% of the world's energy. On average, one American consumes as much energy as two people in Japan, six people in Mexico, 13 people in China, 31 people in India, 128 people in Bangladesh, 307 people in Tanzania, and 370 people in Ethiopia. American society is built on consumption. We are valued as consumers before we are valued as citizens. But what happens when we consume? Are we able to buy something once and be satisfied? No. Corporations keep us coming back for more. Planned obsolescence, fluctuating trends, and growing ease of use make it so we can never stop. We will continue to consume as long as companies can make us feel like our lives would be better if only we had the newer, better version. And what happens to all of the things that we buy? Each year, the average American throws away 48 pounds of books, 25 pounds of paper, 22 pounds of paper plates or cups, 28 pounds of aluminum cans, 77 pounds of plastic bottles and jars, 90 pounds of old clothes and shoes, 77 pounds of cardboard boxes, and 220 pounds of food. We have created an industry of single-use objects that are designed to be discarded. We use things until we tire of them. When we get bored of them, we throw them away. It would take 4.4 Earth's worth of resources to sustain the planet if everyone lived like Americans.